head of the political military section, had gone to the ambassador and the deputy chief of mission and said, I sure as hell, excuse me, am not going to have a woman in my political military section, full stop, end of conversation. A deputy chief of mission and the ambassador both said, oh yes, you are. One of the things that I have felt very grateful for in my career is I've never felt that there's any kind of a glass ceiling at the State Department. I have felt um, and we I've had role models that have said that women can achieve um, any anything within State Department. I think um, there are probably very few women and very few people of color who have not encountered something yes. along the way and there are probably um, far more experiences where you don't know something happened <laughs> yes. than yes. Um, the ones where you also know that it happened. Until but you it, all talk to each other and, and you, you realize said, you've all what? had the same experiences. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, and so of course things have happened along the way um, and I think uh, what that has taught me over time is the importance of mentorship and peers that are both your age as well as a little bit senior to you because what that allows you is when you're in those situations where things um, may not go the way you think, um, it gives you a sounding board and um, a network around you that to help you navigate through those situations and to think how to handle them well. So I've always always sought jobs to do uh, that are different and at every step. So um, looking at that, I think in making sure that I had the self-confidence to yeah. present myself mm -hmm. uh, and also to know your stuff before you walk into a rumor meeting and because whatever initial again unconscious bias not yeah. outright discrimination yeah. people may have towards you the minute you start talking and you articulate the substance and the policy yeah. all that disappears right and even though I still walk into meetings and I mentally make a count, okay, one woman, yeah. three yeah. Uh, I don't think people of color, that <laughs> that's an automatic thing. Yeah, I think yeah. many of us just do. <laughs> yeah. um, but I use that as an empowerment tool yeah. that I'm here to represent and I'm yeah. going to do my best. Yeah.